Hello and welcome to another cherry vlog. This time we're going to go back and look into the past once again. But first of all, I just want to give a big shout out to James Van Das and his wonderful lady Stacey for both being such fun, faithful viewers. Uh, but anyway, on to the next thing. Time for another look back in time. Uh, so I thought we'd have a little look at, since I had showed you the first film I ever made, I'll show you the rather equally awful sequel to that first ever film we made not too long after way back in those college days. This is nothing from Martin 2, even less. And it's even less good than the first one. No, it's fun, it's great. You'll enjoy. I wonder why they want us to come in. <laughs> Maybe they want to congratulate us. Some good f weeks of filming. Oui, oui. Mm. I have here a letter from our accountants. 13 million dollars on a chair. 7.2 billion euros on a haircut. This is, this is unacceptable. This is unacceptable. Oh, oh, no. oh. Paper, you dropped your. You have been filming for over two weeks now. We gave you a budget of two hundred million dollars. You spent ninety-eight million dollars on one scene. One scene at the cost of ninety-eight million dollars. This does not make us happy, does it? What do you have to say for yourselves? <laughs> well, well, you see, I thought the budget was all right. I mean, you accounted for it. You needed that shot, didn't you? I do not answer to a German. Oh, okay. Well, it was a 15 goddamn minutes! That's all you got? You spent that much money in explosion, a large crane falling down, an enormous truck plowing into a field of expensive cars, and all you've got is this 10 minutes of shoddy shots. For God's sake, we don't have any that much money. You're meant to be creating a free to half hour epic, and this is all you've got for us? You Jesus Christ! You think this makes us happy? It saddens me. You're disgusting. You yes. underestimate me, French. How could you spend 1.5 billion on a shoot? It's ridiculous! I mean, we're meant to be preparing some sort of fantastic film for the Sundance Film Festival so that we can prepare an epic to show them. You're meant to be this visionary director, and you are meant to be one of the best producers in the business, and you come up with this! You spend all the money on crap! And how many Lamborghinis do you need? Okay, yeah, oh, well, five. Five's not enough, is it? Five's not enough. Because you think, you know, the audience are not going to go, oh, there's only five Lamborghinis. It's disappointing. I'm going to leave now. You crushed 26 Lamborghinis. Have you any idea how much they cost us yet? That bill's not even come in. Ah! I think a point here, gentlemen, is you're fired. <laughs> Get out! You're more than fired. I'm gonna make sure that you can't work in that business for the next ten years. In fact, because ever! Do not like the screaming. Oh. Get out of my office! Get out of my bloody oh, office! Jesus, come on! Get out we now! Can, we can shoot dead children in Africa. All dying. More dramatic. 
No, no more of your bullshit. What a waste of money. Oh, what well. A terrible waste. I think I'll get one of my uh, favourite Jean Ts flown over from a nice little uh, cafe in uh, London, one of my private jets. And you know what? I got some nice for for a grab. 125 milligrams? Pure. It's fantastic. I only took about 25 what, what, flocks. Why don't we just have a race in our, our private jets and go pick them up ourselves? Yeah, we'll get uh, one of the limos to take us. Or well, the stretch hammer. I can't decide. Good. Hmm. Yeah, well, I am taking me on jet though. Last time you fucked for unbearable. Mm, for a comment, right? Okay. See you there.